Hi, today I'm going to show you how to do Despicable Me now. What you'll need is a bobby pin, um, some sort of makeup sponge, um, a very thin paintbrush, um, white nail polish, yellow nail polish, and a dark navy blue polish, and also a top coat, and nail polish remover and a cotton ball. So what you're going to do first is you're going to take your cotton ball and you're going to take your nail polish remover and you're just going to dump it in a little, just a little, like don't, don't want anything down. So take your bobby pin, make sure it's clean, take your uh, brush, make sure it's clean, make sure everything's clean. might look clean, but the second time you go clean it, there's always a little dirt on it. Um, so first you take a yellow color and you paint the nail as you'd want it to be painted obviously so you paint the whole nail yellow I'm going to do two of my nails and show you how to do this so to show you that it's not just like a thumb thing it's a little finger thing too I would do all my fingers but one of my fingers is not very pretty right now because um, I broke it I'll show you guys it's very disturbing, I don't know how to show it to you, I don't know if you can see it very well, but like right, right here, it's like missing a part, it's really nasty, alright, that doesn't matter, so, basically, now that I have my yellow color, um, I'm gonna do another layer, because yellow is really light, um, this yellow that I'm using is NYC, and it is called, um, it doesn't have a name, but it has a number. The number is, um, 114A, right? And then I'm going to just paint my other nail. Just finish painting it, that's all I have to do. So for the next part, um, it might be easier to put some, uh, hold on, sorry, it was like all like, <laughs> it might be easier to put like, um, like that. Make sure my phone on silent because that's annoying. Alright, so basically, I'm just usually a person could put tape on the tip of their nail, but I don't do that because my brush for this is really small. So, what I'm just gonna do is I'm just gonna take it and just put like a little pair of pants on my little, my little minion, and then. I'm going to do the other one, and I'll just get a little pair of pants on him. Just one little line is fine. Doesn't have to be fancy or anything. No fancy at all, see? Actually messed up a little, got a little smeariness on this now, so I'm going to go over that little part with the yellow. That's my big yellow thing. Alright. So after you do that, oh, I forgot black. Oh my god, that's so silly. I forgot. I need black nail polish too. So you're going to take your sponge, and you're going to take a block first. And you're basically just going to take out this, and just drop a little dab on your thing, your little sponge. And then you're going to take the end of your bobby pin, make sure it still has the circle stuff on it. And you're gonna dip it in that, and you're gonna draw an eyeball for each one. So it's like going to do two eyeballs because they don't all just have one eyeball. The cute ones have one eyeball, but they're all cute, honestly. I love them all. They're all my favorites. So. Well, I would run out. <laughs> I didn't put enough nail polish on this one in the first place. That's fine. So I'll do it 
go. Nothing a little more nail polish could have fit. Ah! Happened again. Wait, stop it. Right. Ah! Then I take this. And I just slowly just dab it on like eyeballs. Um, their eyeballs don't even have to be the same size, honestly. Like, for me, honestly, I think that she really should have didn't have eyeballs in size. So now that you have your little black eyeballs, then you're going to take the exact same thing that you just had, and you're going to make sure you took off everything that was on it with the cotton ball that you put nail polish maker on earlier. Ah, I got cotton stuck on my little eyeball. Oh, well, whatever. And then you're going to take your white nail polish, and you're going to do the same thing when it comes to, like, the whole, like, dipping, you know? So once you've done that, you basically just take your poly pin again, and you dip it into this, and you're going to draw a little white dot inside of your black. So it's going to look like this. <laughs> you can't really see what my fingers are. Alright. Now, this is the tricky part. Once you've done that, you're going to take your black again. Um, and you're going to dip it on this. <coughs> oh, bless me. Sorry. And you're just gonna dip it in like that a little more. And then you're gonna take your brush and you're gonna put a little dip in it. And then right in the middle, you're gonna just draw a little eyeball. For each eye. So now it should look like this. Alright. So after you've done that, you dip in a little more. And using the same paintbrush, you draw a little trail for where his glasses go. Honestly, these things are so cute. Like, I wish I could have a pet minion. It'd be, like, the best thing ever. Alright. So, now I've done that. I'm done with my eyeballs. Now, you add, like, a little pieces of hair. Um, my nails aren't very long, so I can't exactly do pieces of hair. But if you have longer hair, you can do pieces of hair. This is my attempt at little pieces of hair. And so after you've done that, you draw a little face on them. Like a little, little smile or something. Just little, nothing cute little smile, yeah. And then you do one on the other one. Um, it'd be better to have them all have different facial expressions, but me personally, I like them all to just have like a little half grin on the side, because I think that's like the cutest thing ever. Especially on minions, because minions are just, oh my god, they're cute. Always. So, once you've done that, you have little minions. This is minion number one, and this is minion number two. And once you've done your minion, you just put everything aside, take a clear coat, and you go over it all. You have to be careful though, like me, mine aren't even all the way dry. But I'm still doing it because just to show you guys what you're supposed to do. Don't do what I do though because I'm not a professional, but I'm pretty good at putting on nail polish, nail polish or something that's not even dry yet. Alright, and then after that, you take your whatever you use to clean up the sides. You can use um, a Q-tip. Um, 
fat brush like this, like a little like um like with a little angle. Let me find my angled brush. Uh, I can't find my angled brush right now, but a little like angled brush for cotton ball. And basically that is how you do making it.